Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Blind Play Chrono Trigger. I'm Ultima Mantoid. Um, I have not updated this Let's Play in about a week. I've had a couple of issues. There it is, that's what I was looking for. I looked through my inventory and I made sure, it was like, cause see, I actually have the Dreamstone. I didn't realize that I had the Dreamstone. Um, there it is. But yeah, I've not updated this because I've actually been kind of depressed lately. Um, I've just had some real life stuff going on that I can't do much about. And, uh, so I've just got to suck it up, put on my big boy pants one leg at a time, and just deal with it. So, here we are. I'm in a better mood, though. Better mindset, better headspace, so... Again, my apologies for no updates. I've actually had a little bit of time to update, but the last week of work has pretty much been like a form of hell on Earth. So, and yes, I do realize Ayla's not in my party, and I don't know why, but I've got the Dreamstone. I want to go back, and I want to end up... Uh, want to end up uh, mending Masamune so I can have... Frog! Join my party, because I want frog. Must have frog. Froggy, froggy, froggy! Will you stop bumping me with your chest? I'm about to break out some skills. Because I am going through a gate, why not? You know what? I did it again. I just realized I haven't turned my volume up again. God, I usually remember that. I'm also not recording at my usual hour either, so... Oh! Marl learns what? Cure! Sweet! Actual magic! Oh, nice. I'm surprised I didn't get a... Oh, right, because it's magic, maybe? Oh! Why, well, I didn't even know I could scroll down her dur. There's only a flashing arrow. Anyway, give me just a second. There we go. That's better. I turned my music up. Oh, gosh. Oh wow, I was I was okay. They were just like running around me there. The moment that I tried to walk, it was like, no, fuck you. I wanna see what cure does. Or what it looks like. Whoa. Oh, perfect. Oh, you moved. You moved. You bastard. Okay, she just smacks her ass, and it's like, come here. Oh, 
You know, I always wondered, I mean, it makes sense from like a, you know, I guess a realistic thought perspective. Confusion is like the easiest status to break in any RPG. Just smack a bitch. Is there anything up that way? No, there wasn't. I actually didn't realize that Ayla gave me the moonstone there. Yes. Going into the gate. Dog gate. It's being MP restored. Forget how beautiful they are. You don't need to find someone that can process that mineral. You'll probably find him in Medina Village, or in Medina, a village near the Mystic Mountains. Let me check my party. Let's switch out Luca. Just for a little bit. Besides, I think I have some shit to equip on you, Robo. Or did I already give it to you? Wow! That would make him, like, super tanky. That will probably be a huge late game. Considering he's got a heal as well, that's probably not a bad idea. Though I have no idea what stamina does. Or vi yeah. Vigor. Somebody help me out here. I'm assuming Vigor is their HP increase. So maybe I should keep that on for leveling purposes. All right, let's go back to Medina Village. No. Yes. No, I know what I need to do. I need to go back to the future. And go pick up that item that's next to Johnny. Can't remember who said it, but I need to go do that. Which, it's not so far out of the way, so... I can just go get it. Welcome to the future. Everything is shiny here. I'm gonna go back and see what that item was. Somebody told me it wasn't important, but I've still got to know what it was. You know, satiate my curiosities. Whoa! Three of them? Really? I'm doing laser spin. Fuck all the things. Disco Rave Ball, go! Or disco rave bot. There it is. That's the item that they're talking about. Really? You really want to do this?
I think shadows are the ones that are immune to... Yeah. Race log? Oh, that's the race log. Okay. I actually like watching that ability in action. Wow, I figured out how to dodge him. Okay, that was it. It was just the race log. Nope, I can't dodge him. I tried. I really tried, guys! I'm sorry! At least I know. Let's try going down under it. Nope. I tried. I tried. Didn't want to fight it. That's okay. I'll just use like ridiculously awesome techniques. Hit all of the enemies. Now let me make sure I'm not missing anything here. Okay. That's what it was. It was a race log. I thought it was like an ether or something. Why am I not going in the protodome? Nah. <laughs> okay, now we'll go back to Medina Village. And we'll take that to Melchior, then we'll go back to 600 whatsever AD and... <sighs> I had to get my water. It was on my bed. And I had to reach for it. Which reminds me of that line out of Biodome, which had Polly Shore in it. He's like, reach for it! When they ask him where the keys are and he's showing them their, his ass. Yeah. You found some dreamstone, then I'll repair the Masamune. How on earth did you get the Masamune and the dreamstone? No, don't tell me. I don't think my heart could take it. I'll take a little while. To, it'll take a little while to fix this. Well, I shall help also. Oh, well, that's cool. These repairs seem quite difficult. All right then. Okay, so I lose Robo temporarily. Chrono, where are you going? Masamune is a fixie. Oh, I'm supposed to wait. Well, in the meantime, I'm gonna search his upstairs for nothing. Hey, <laughs> I would love to 
like have a moment in an RPG where you're like searching somebody's house for items or whatever, and you like open somebody's like chest of drawers or something, and it just says, "You obtained nothing." That's right, nothing. At any rate, leave us to me. To prepare the mo monster meeting, we must process the dreamstone and activate the sword. You work on the dreamstone, and I'll work on the sword. Understood. I like how it just slides off the table and then back onto the table. That's the dreamstone, huh? Alright, it's done. Now bring me the dreamstone. Oh, you actually get to watch them. Okay, understood. I bet Luca would also help out if she's in your party. Alright, let's get started. What the? What in the hell? Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, wow. Isn't that just pristine? Take a good look. This is the Masamune. Awesome, what a weapon. Well, I think that's everything. Okay, Chrono, let's take the Masamune back to Frog. Thank you, dude. This weapon represents considerable power. Your actions may either save or destroy life. Wield your sword with full knowledge of the consequences. Would you like to buy something? Sure. Since you helped me out, let me see if you've got anything I might need. No. No. Thank you, though. Alright, now let's go back to 600 years in the past. Wait. Masamune. Yep, Frog is the only one that can equip it. <sighs> My ear itches. I hate it when my ear itches in the middle of a recording. And since I didn't have to fight anything... No, that's 65 million years. Okay. No, it's current. I think that's where I need to go, but I want to make sure. No, not Bangor Dome. Lean Square, no. Yep, that's the one I need. All these different waypoints. And I bet there's two more because it looks like there's two more spaces. Holding L and R. Don't give a shit. Not fighting. Fuck all the fucking fuckers. And they're playing ball with the roly poly, yay. Something weird I have noticed about this game, and it was actually problematic back on part one. Uh, setting up the screen size. Um, because in, like, this world mode right here, like, you see all of the screen, right? But as soon as I walk into. Oh, here the cursed woods. The bottom no longer reaches the actual bottom. It's a really odd thing that I've noticed about this game. I don't know if that's done in the original cartridge, but it's definitely something that has me intrigued. Okay, frog. Cheer up, buddy. I got you a sword. Tis thee again. The sword. Tis the Masamune? You can't be serious, Frog. I must ponder this turn of events. Remain remaineth here the night. I thought he was just going like, to walk away and be like, No, I didn't get it myself. It's 
Cyrus, are you leaving? Yes, it's time we took back the metal from the Frog King. And I'd like to see that mythical sword for myself. Oh no. Frog King. But Cyrus, the kingdom needs you. And Lean and I need you. You must return to us. As long as there is life in these bones, I shall return. By your leave. I'm gonna have to fight Cyrus, huh? Sir Cyrus! We, the Knights of the Square Table... <laughs> that still cracks me up. We, the Knights of the Square Table, wish you a safe journey. Listen well, my friends. Now entrust the safety of the kingdom to you. Pardon the delay. Shall we be off? Glenn, you be careful too. Be of sound health, your majesty. Who is Glenn? Is that like Glenn Beck? So, you want to, the badge of courage, dear knight of the kingdom. Well, come and take it if you can. Grab it. Prepare yourself, Pollywog. On guard. Nirvana strike. God, how dare you pick on a helpless amphibian. Filthy metal. I won't forget this. Oh. Ah! Beware, Glenn. Cyrus, the sword! The Masamune! <gasps> I was right. <laughs> Is that the best you can do? No, maybe I'm wrong. Without your sword, you're nothing! Ah, uh, you haven't beaten me yet. S Cyrus, I'm a g goner. Glenn, escape while I keep them at bay. B but if you stay, they'll get us both. Go on, Glenn. You'd better worry more about yourself, Cyrus. And there's Magus. Come on, Glenn, go! Ah! Oh, jeez! Cyrus! Glenn, get the hell out of there! R run, Glenn! The Queen, take care of Lean. S Cyrus? Cyrus! Well, never mind. I won't be fighting Cyrus, sir, not appearing in this video game. Harumph! What's the matter? Aren't you going to try your luck? Uh. <laughs> Can't get your tongue, kid. And somebody made it aware that apparently it's Ozzy from. It's supposed to be like representing Ozzy of Black Sabbath, and there's two others of, I think, Flea. Which is from Red Hot Chili Peppers and somebody else. So I'm looking forward to seeing them. How about it, Magus? Can't you give him a more fitting form? Alright, why not? There's always time for a little fun. Uh, ah! Ah! Whoa, he, he fell off the mountain. <laughs> you spineless wimp. Wait a second, hang on. Frog is Glenn. Okay. Ten years hath passed. Can I do it? I've changed so much. Alas, poor Cyrus. So, Magus and Ozzy broke the Masamune. Awaketh, Chrono. I should have named you Glenn. Though we may fail, let us go to Magus's lair. Thou knowest his power? We must do it to save our future. We won't be beaten by a bad guy. Okay.
Uh, tough decision. I actually get access to Aura Horal with Marl and Chrono, so I'm actually going to keep Marl. critical hit rate of the Masamune, but I can't equip the Masamune. I guess I'm not supposed to yet. Let's see, it's right here. Something has to be up with that sword right now. Organize. Wait, what's three? Oh, three gold suits. I need to go sell some of those. I don't really need them. This is why I keep extra inventory items in RPG games. In case there are party members that join that are kind of underpowered. Oh, I almost got out of the stinking woods. Good. Magus' Lair. Before I do that, let me check how long I've been recording. Okay, I'm just gonna go to Magus' Lair, and then I'll save it. Did I come into this village? Yes, I did. Fiona's Villa. Oh, yeah. This place will probably be important later. Magic Cave. I believe this is the place. Because there's uh, no nowhere else I could think of. Ah! Uh, hey, you! It's Cyrus! Run for your lives! Thanks, Cyrus. Hey. Glenn, there are times when people simply have to grit their teeth. But it hurts when I get hit. They... You're a marshmallow, Glenn. Marshmallows are delicious. So that means that Glenn is very tasty. And since he's turned into a frog, this game is telling you frog legs are tasty. Hey, Glenn, I've been thinking about becoming a knight. I knew you were going to enlist. You'll make a great warrior. Why don't you join too? I don't think I'd make the cut. But why? You're better with a sword than I am. I don't know. I think I'd really lose it if I had to hurt someone. Ah, uh, poor Glenn. Poor frog. And the hero metal washed down the river, down the mountain. The metal. The hero's metal.
handeth over the Masamune. Sword that is as big as Chrono. Uh, he said hand it over, not shove it in the ground. My name is Glenn, Cyrus's hopes and dreams, and now the Masamune. Forthwith I shall slay Magus and restore honor. Holy shit! Well! I, uh... I'm Ultimate Mantoid, and this is Let's Blind Play Chrono Trigger. Uh, till next time, take care and have fun! Hell, that was a slice!